Hello everyone, I'm Ronald Mehta and welcome back to digit.com, a platform where we make life easy for management students worldwide. In this video on the subject of retail management, we are going to cover the topic on category management. The video throws light on interrelated products as treated by a retailer so as to woo customers into the store. Additionally, the role of category captains performed by manufacturers is also fleshed out in this video. The video also takes a stab at how retailers such as Walmart and Carrefour appoint leading FMCG brands as their category captains. So now, let's start with a brief introduction on category management. A category is a group of products or services that consumers perceive to be interrelated or substitutable. Category management is a way of managing products on the level of a product group rather than on the level of a single product. Now let's look at the importance of category management. First, changes in the consumer needs and lifestyle. Consumer needs and lifestyle across the world have changed dramatically over the past decade. Retailers and suppliers have been forced to better understand consumer needs and to meet those needs more efficiently. If a retailer adopts category management, he can focus better on the consumer and define his categories accordingly. Next, competitive pressure. Retailers have to be all more competitive due to emergence of new and big formats of retail like the hypermarkets. In order to compete effectively against these new forms of competition, retailer has to carefully devise and implement his categories accordingly. Next, economic and efficiency considerations. The increasing pressure on profitability makes it necessary for the retailers to focus on controlling of cost. Category management can help in achieving greater economic efficiencies. Next, advances in information technology. Retailers can share and exchange huge amount of information with the help of IT. The retailer can obtain, organize, access, analyze and act upon data required for effective category management. This would ultimately enable them to have a better understanding of consumer needs and achieve competitive advantage. And finally, the category management process. It entails about 8 steps and it is an industry standard for category management as stated by the partnering group. Step 1 is defining the category. Step 2 is define the role of the category within the retailer. Step 3 assess the current performance. Step 4 set objectives and targets for the category. Step 5 devise an overall strategy. Then ultimately step 6 would be breaking down the strategy in specific tactics, implementing it, finally reviewing the whole process. Now let's look at another interrelated topic of category captain. So who is a category captain? Let's take a stab at that. The entire process of category management revolves around the partnership between the supplier and the retailer. Many retailers follow the method of appointing category captains to develop a category and further partnership. The retailers select a vendor to help them manage a particular category. The vendor known as a category captain works with the retailer to develop a better understanding of shopping behavior, create assortments that will satisfy customer needs and improve the profitability of the merchandise category. Thus, the category captain is a supplier who forms an alliance with the retailer. Moving on to the roles and responsibilities of a category captain. First, planogram or modular responsibilities. Next, weekly reporting of category results, key sales data. Then comes marketplace analysis to determine whether a retailer is winning or losing and providing insights as to why. Next, strategic yearly review by category for insights into tactics and strategies. And finally, ad hoc analysis per buyer request. Ultimately, any category captain would entail the following advantages. First, it makes merchandise management tasks easier and can increase profits. Next, vendors are often in a better position to manage a category than our retailers because they have superior information because of their focus on one specific category. And finally, they have acquired insights from managing the category for other retailers. An example of category captain. Many retailers and manufacturers in the consumer goods industry practice category partnership and report positive benefits. Did you know, retailers such as Walmart, Metro and Kroger usually assist manufacturers such as Kraft Foods, P&G, Kellogg and Danone to serve as category captains. Carrefour, the second largest retailer in the world, requested Colgate to serve as a category captain in the oral care category. It worked wonders for Colgate and Carrefour. Colgate suggested that Carrefour restructure a display in the oral care category so as to merchandise toothbrush products above toothpaste products as opposed to merchandising them next to each other. As a result of these insights and restructuring, Carrefour reported 6 to 16% sales increase in the oral care categories in its retail markets. So that's it folks, this brings an end to the topic on category management. These are the list of sources and links referred to for the content in the video. Thank you.